to Moo Moo Math and Science and an introduction to the coordinate planes. And in this I'll talk about plotting ordered pairs on the coordinate plane. Let's first talk a little bit about the coordinate plane. The coordinate plane is created when two perpendicular, perpendicular lines intersect to form the coordinate plane. Okay, And if you recall, a perpendicular line or lines are two lines that cross at 90 degrees. So these would be perpendicular lines. Okay. Next, the horizontal line. And remember, horizontal, I'll draw one. A horizontal line is the x axis, and then the vertical line is the y axis. Okay. And a vertical line would go up and down. Okay. Next, the ordered pair 0, 0 is called the origin. And also, when plotting the origin, always start, excuse me, when plotting ordered pairs, always start at the origin. And again, it's 0, 0. Okay. Let's point out a couple other items. Next. The x coordinate is always the first, excuse me, the x coordinate is always the first number in the ordered pair and indicates how many spaces to the left or right you move from the origin. So you're going to be moving left and right, and it's the first. And then the y coordinate is the second number, it indicates how many spaces move up or down. Okay? So x is running this way. Y is running vertical. Okay. Now, let's talk about a couple other things. Next, the coordinate plane is divided up into four quadrants. And these four quadrants, they move in a counterclockwise fashion. And so this is quadrant one. Then we move in this fashion, quadrant two. Then we go to quadrant three, and then quadrant four. Okay, so let's look at this and number a couple of the things. So again, the coordinate plane is divided into four quadrants, and they move in a counterclockwise direction. So quadrant one, the x coordinate is positive, and the y coordinate is positive. So the ordered pair will be positive, positive. Next, quadrant 2 is negative, positive. So it's going to be negative and then positive. Quadrant 3 is negative, negative. And quadrant 4 is positive, negative. Okay? And I'll show you what that looks like right here. Again, notice quadrant one, you're going to have, you'd have a positive two, positive two. Over here, you would have a negative three, positive two. Here, both are going to be negative. And this one, you will have a positive x, negative y. So now that we've done a couple of things, this is also uh, important to note, is that if points on the x or y axis are not in any now let's go ahead and plot a couple numbers. Let's start with the first one, and I've kind of drawn in the directions. But I'll explain this. We have negative 3 and 2. Remember, the first number is the x, and it always, is always horizontal. The second number is y, and it is vertical. Remember, we start at the origin, so we're going to start negative 3. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3 to the left, and up 2. 1, 2. And that gives you... A. And it is going to be in quadrant 2. Okay, so there's quadrant 2. Next, we have 5, negative 3. Start at 0, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. But then we're going to go down negative 3, 1, 2, 3. So B would be here, and it is in quadrant 4. And you can see 
I've written, quadrant four. Okay. Let's try number th letter C, negative one, negative four. Start at the origin, negative one, negative four. This would be C. It is in quadrant three. And I've written that in three. Okay. Next, let's go with letter D. Start at the origin, two, negative five. One, two, three, four, five. So right here is D. It is in quadrant four. Okay. And I've written that in right here. And finally, E. I didn't write that in. Sorry. We're going to start at the origin, which is zero. So it, X is zero. And we're going to go up two. So this would be E. And remember, zeros are not in any quadrant. So it is on the Y axis. Okay, so notice I've written on the y-axis. So in recap, remember when you plot numbers, x, which is horizontal, is first, y, which is vertical, is second. Always start at the origin, which is 0, 0, and plot away. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.